It looks like we're actually got everything focused, running live. It looks like the hangout is online. All right, welcome everybody to the uh, Thursday, February 6th Global Takeover webinar. We got Luke Vincent in the house here with us tonight. My name is Andrew Newman, as you guys know, and tonight we're actually going to be talking a little bit about what's my most favorite part of this business, which is the affiliate side. And uh, Luke's got some stuff that he can share. He doesn't really know it yet, but we're going to throw him under the bus and kind of blow him up as kind of a little bit of a Facebook guru because uh, he's built multiple organizations in multiple different companies with nothing but free marketing on Facebook. And we'll get to hear what he's got to say a little bit about that here tonight, uh, as well as show you guys what we've been able to put together over the last week and a half or so uh, to be able to help you really build your business um, the right way, which is which is really where there's a breakdown online. A lot of people are trying to push their own personalized systems and 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 things of that nature. Um, but what you're doing here guys when you're when you're out there promoting another system, while they're awesome and yes they work really well and you can use them, especially if you're just getting started, what your ultimate goal should be is to control all of the traffic, to control every aspect of your marketing funnel and bring you to the point where you you're not sharing the leads with others uh, within your system. And that's really really what it comes down to is three main components. Number one is you owning the website, the domain, um, the hosting account, and everything that goes along with that that you're advertising. Now, a lot of these systems are actually teaching you to do partials on this thing. We're telling you to go pick up a go domain at GoDaddy um, and then just forward that over to the capture page of the systems, which is fantastic. It works really well, and anybody can do that. So when you're getting started out, that's fine. Uh, but what you want to do is you want to really dig into the meat of this. And we're going to show you through Global Wealth Takeover how you can actually build a, a functioning sales funnel and how re really easy it actually is. We've got a couple of domain hosts and things like that uh, that you guys are going to really like because it's really push button software. We're not going to have to do any FTP, no cPanel, none of that stuff that sounds all scary where they've got all kinds of, of, of little intricate things that you can make mistakes on, especially if this is your first run through this business. Then we're going to show you how you can get an autoresponder system that not only is highly highly effective in the deliverability, but incredibly cheap when compared to every other autoresponder on the, on the internet, as well as probably one of the best affiliate programs um, as well to go along with it. Not only is it inexpensive, but you're going to get 5,000 subscribers for $9.97 a month, but it, it has a really awesome comp plan to go along with it where they pay out 300% commissions, as well as residual commissions as well. So everything that you guys are going to be putting together throughout the, the sales funnel building process is a affiliate program as well as a tool and resource that you're going to be using to build your business, which is important. Um, and that's going to really create our own um, economy, if you will. We're all going to be keeping the money within the team as much as we can. We're not going to be going outside of it, getting GoDaddy hosting here, HostGator hosting there, Bluehost over here, so we're all spread all over the board. Everything's going to be all in one neat little package that, that, that you're going to be able to learn that you're going to be able to teach other people and is going to be consistent when you teach it, they teach it, and everybody else teaches it, which is one of the keys to duplication. Um, and then what we're going to show you here tonight is an autoresponder campaign. I think there's 45, 47 emails or something like that in the campaign that's really going to, that we're going to show you how to build your list with and then follow up. Okay, this is the stuff that we've been working on behind the scenes uh, and it's really why we've been so quiet recently. So just to give you guys kind of an idea as to what we'll be doing um, in the long run is to build a profitable business using e-commerce on the front end okay, to fund your marketing until you get to the point where you no longer have to participate in the e-commerce unless you like it that much. Okay, um, Some people really do enjoy it and that's fine. You're welcome to stay doing that. That's, that's your business. So, um, Luke, did you have anything that you wanted to share? You've been able to see a lot about uh, what we've been building recently, you've been able to go through, get your email campaign. Um, do you like the way the system's set up? Do you think it's going to be easy for everybody when they get started? Um, take away all the scary stuff that's involved with building your own <laughs> website. Sure, sure. By the way, hi everyone. Um, how are you doing? Then? While you're saying about the system, I think um, the system's simplistic. Instead of you know using somebody else's marketing funnel, which is going to get overpopulated, everybody's going to be using it. We've got a really simple system put together, which it's easy and it's going to be unique. You know, it's going to be unique too. Everybody's going to have um, different landing pages. Um, you know, you can edit your um, your campaigns and stuff like that. You know, 
the system is easy. <laughs> is is just literally easy. You know, just taking step by step. And when Andrew's mentioning about all using the same, you know, hosting servers, autoresponder, and stuff like that, it makes so much sense because if you've got a question, if I'm using a different autoresponder and you know Andrew's got a campaign for me to load, it's going to cause some, you know, um, some problems. I can't load it into another autoresponder. So when you're all using the same tools and services. There's video set up where you can just go to get access to it and just work our way through. And I actually had one person um, last week who was using a different auto response, and this is how I learned. <laughs> From the start, I should have, you know, mentioned, you know, our system exactly what we do because she had a few questions and she um, she wanted, you know, some landing pages and some more responders set up. And because she was using a different order responder, I couldn't give them to her directly, just like, you know, load them up into an order and, you know, get a separate GVO. But now I know for the future, <laughs> since the systems all get put together, and I've just been working in the background with them, um, you know, we're still testing things, learning how things work, in, but it's really, really simple, especially with GVO. You know, just get your dom um, domain name, your WS domain name. Get your um, blog set up and get your marketing funnel um, set up. It's not as if you've got an FTP and starting that stuff. There's a little button and you're just clicking it, so you install WordPress and that's it. <laughs> then you can install a capture page and we can start collecting leads. And remember, it's unique. Nobody else is going to have the exact same capture page as you. With a uh, with the company's one, they're all the same. And you, you know, you've got thousands and thousands of people using the same landing pages. At some point or another, it's going to go for populated. And when you bring people into the system, in the, into our team, you can then teach them how to do exactly the same thing. So not only are they learning how to jump on board and start selling this combination, but also how to build their own marketing funnel for future systems that do from that. And they're getting the main tools and services they need. For a responder, a website, and a marketing funnel, and something to sell. <laughs> and all of these things leverage and make us money. And you know, they, all of the things put together, like the the e-commerce as, as a start, you know, you don't need to recruit, you don't need to refer, you just make money from using eBay. That's fantastic. But you want to start leveraging and leveraging a lot to start getting a residual coming in, then the affiliate side is perfect. But that's actually that that I mean, you couldn't have put it any better yourself. I mean, Janelle's over here, and what she's saying is that the whole thing can be done in one day, which is <laughs> awesome. Um, especially if you if you don't have any experience, you can still put together the entire system in one day. Okay, what we're showing you how to do, and then you can think outside of the box. You personally will go in and and turn this into your own personalized system. Okay, so what I can show you how to do is how to build a sales funnel, like I build a sales funnel. Okay, and there's things that you would respond to that that I did I don't personally put into mind. So you would actually say, you know, maybe maybe I should make a tweak here, and you will test. Now, Everything, guys, everything within marketing is a test. Like Luke was mentioning, when people are using these systems, um, people start advertising the same capture page, same capture page, same capture page, and it becomes it, – it, people become numb to it when they see it that they already know even if they've never actually opted into one of those capture pages and don't worry if you know what any of this stuff means right now you will as you, you're progressing through the system um, if they haven't they'll actually make an assumption in their mind that they already know what that's about a prime example would be Vic with Big Idea Mastermind inside of Empower yeah. Network what he did was he waited a year until the company had some traction going had some real real stories to talk about and then he came in and in in <laughs> <laughs> in 28 days, he, he made $710,000 because what he did was he took it, he, he created his own system is what he did um, and then had other people using that system but it was a different capture page that was being shown to the market. So what they went into is they went into solo ads and they started running the solo ads with a different marketing funnel than was running prior to that because everybody who knows um, online marketing knows about solo ads and anybody who's on this webinar right now if you don't know what that stuff is but when you're on our team you're going to progress through some things and you're going to learn all this stuff uh, but one of, our, one of our business partners Sean he had mentioned uh, what he wanted to do was be able to get a system that he had created banned from solo ads 
And, and if anybody's ever placed a solo edge, you'll understand what we mean by that. And Power Network is one of those those systems that was that you can't really buy solo ads for anymore because so many people went in and purchased mm -hmm. solo ads for the same capture page using the same sales funnels. Okay, Big Idea Mastermind got banned. Pure Leverage got banned from solo ads. If you go into a mm -hmm. lot of these really high quality solo ad providers, right in their terms and conditions, they say no dot com secrets X, no. Um, and Power Network, no Big Idea Mastermind, no Easy Money Network, no none of these systems that just blew up online. And if you can imagine yeah. how big that is for you as an individual who created that system, to be able to get put on these different solo ad providers lists as, hey, we can't send solo ads for your system anymore because we've sent too many. You know what I mean? That's that's really the sure, meaning sure. of where we're going with this to teach everybody actually how to be an independent marketer, and that's really important. It's genius. <laughs> it's absolutely genius, Renee. It's really, um, you know, I want to, I want to say thanks again on the webinar to you, Andrew, um, because it's, it is it is really genius. Because it sounds really hard when you first told me we're putting together our own marketing system. I was like, I don't want to do that. <laughs> and then when you told me how easy it was, and um, when I actually got plugged in and started taking action, I started doing it step by step. I started putting videos up on websites and putting a, a prior page, blah, 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 and then I didn't have a clue. If you remember, I didn't have a clue what all the pages were for. And then when it all came together, I was like, here's the marketing plan. <laughs> I was like, wow. It works. So, yeah, it, works. Well. it works really, really well. And it is really, as I mentioned before, it's really, really important that Everybody does get plugged in. We're all using the same tools, and I recently found out that GDI is wrong. <laughs> it is really, really important that we're all using the same tools, and we can. Um, if anyone's got any questions, anyone needs any help, we know exactly what we're doing because we're all, we're all built around. We're all using the same tools and services. All responders, websites, hosting, etc., etc. Training so, will be consistent among every single mm -hmm. person. And that's the that's the whole whole point behind it is to be able to have people become successful, and and, and that's what that's what we really really want. Personally, myself, I can build a sales funnel. Uh, it took me a long time to learn how to do it, and I learned how to do it by watching YouTube videos and Google. And 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 mm -hmm. to be really honest with you, how I learned how to do HTML was from W3Schools.com. If anybody really wants to see how hard that actually is to learn how to do by just going to that website. Go oh, do you remember the little trick? <laughs> <laughs> you did show me an easy trick to be able to do that um, and, and, and some of the coding and stuff like that on the pages, which I, really <laughs> cool. I didn't even think about it, which that, that's that's fantastic. By um, the way, I do not have a clue about HTML, but I, I know HTML really works. HTML is actually fun. It, it, it is fun. This isn't really work to me. This is this is fun. I like create. I like the ability to be able to create. Uh, that, there is something I saw. I don't know of, of if anybody knows anything about politics or not, but um, there's a Democrat senator in California, and she was quoted. Mm -hmm. Uh, because the Affordable Care Act, which is also known as Obamacare, is causing employers' expenses to go up. And one of the first places employers cut expenses is labor. So the, when, when expenses go up, the first thing they do is they lay off a percentage of their employees. Then they determine what they need to do to offset the expense increase, and then they hire back more employees to, to keep things going. Mm -hmm. and, and what they were looking at, they were joking in one of their little press conferences, which is, they, they laugh at it, which is kind of irritating to me as a business owner, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, what they were saying is what we're doing is we're empowering people to go out and be writers and, and pursue their passions and their dreams. The Affordable Care Act isn't costing people jobs. It's liberating people from jobs. It's letting them go out and create, become business owners and things like that. She wasn't really... She was actually, you know, she was condescending when she was saying it, but what she was saying really resonated with me because it's true. The status quo, even in the United States, Luke, you're over there in the United Kingdom. I don't know what it's like there, but the status quo here has been violated. There are too many employees and not enough employers. Now we have an economic problem. Um, so we can actually go out there. We can create independent marketers. We can create independent people who actually, they're not sheep following the herd if you know what I mean. And that's really what we see as a trend in this industry. If you, if you guys pay attention in the groups and stuff like that, there's a lot of people who just don't know what to do and they're looking for advice and they're getting told what to do by people who don't know 
what to do. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what it is, Andrew? My best way of putting that one is, it's, it's like a circle. You have a newbie trying to teach a newbie, and that newbie tries to another newbie, and then nobody ever makes any money. <laughs> right. It's like a circle going around and around, and they're all claiming to be this um, super guru. <laughs> <laughs> just be honest. Just be honest and reach out and help. You know, right? No, nobody's gonna. Nobody starts off with fifty sales. Uh, you know, ten thousand dollars. No, nobody starts off with it. You have to start from somewhere. Be honest and just help. Just help people, and then by you helping people and teaching them things, you know, you can never. They can jump on board with you. They can get other people, and everything starts to leverage, and then you can start sharing the success. I don't do what I've seen some you know videos and stuff and um, little landing pages on some Facebook groups where people you just know they don't have a clue what they're doing and they're, they're telling you how to make money <laughs> all the time, all the time. The blind leading the blind. Uh, the problem is, is nobody knows where they're going. There's a really easy litmus mm -hmm. test um, that that you can do. It is when the person that you're talking to, okay. Whether or not they have money or not does not is not relevant. Is is what they're telling you to do. When you do it, do you make money? <laughs> when you do what they say to do, did you turn a profit? That's what matters. That's the only thing that really matters. And if they're if they're right, their success level at that point in time is not relevant. Okay. What is relevant is the fact that they have told you to do something that worked. Did it produce a result that was positive, the result that you're looking for? And that means that's a person you want to lock arms with. Okay. And that's really got to be the core fundamental behind your marketing is to help other people get a result and, and, and identifying a problem and then providing a solution for that. Now, DS Domination, guys, the company that we've chosen to use as our product to market we're really using this to, to teach people as, as an e-course on how to teach people to sell on eBay. That's what we're doing. Okay, That's when we're doing our marketing. We're, we're showing people how to do that. And, and those of you who are interested in moving into a little bit more income stream, okay, a little bit higher revenue, which is the affiliate marketing side because we have several affiliate streams attached into one little sales and marketing funnel like we were describing earlier. There's actually more than just what we're talking about here in this particular webinar, too. The only thing is, is we don't want to overwhelm people who are watching this video at a later date because these webinars are all being recorded for you guys so you can come back and, and, and we can come back. And we can come back and we can look at our own webinars and we can really find out how we can serve you better. If there's a better way that we can communicate to you, um, please let us know because there's no way that we can improve without your, your input. And that's really important. But... When you guys are moving forward, just identify the problem. DS Domination doesn't have capture pages um, that they provide you unless you pay $199 for Market Extreme. Then you have to have AWeber or GetResponse or some other crazy one I've never heard of, iBizWave or something. I've never even heard of it um, to be able to to use their Market Extreme package, right? And they have some email follow-ups and things like that, but there's not really a lot of actual value there. So you've got people going out where they can create a system. For example, Unit of Prosperity, which is we are a member of the Unit of Prosperity. They have an awesome system put together. But again, guys, it's outside of the training that we're teaching people to use GBO and Pure Leverage as their autoresponder um, and eventually moving into a little bit more of the functionality of the GBO system, which Luke has actually recently discovered a lot more value within GBO than he understood was there prior to even last week. Um, so as the, as the book continues to open and we continue to turn pages, it just gets better and better for the future of everybody. You know what it is? GVO has, it has so, GVO has so much inside it. I don't think even Andrew, you don't even. I don't think you even know everything that's inside GVO. There is so much for your dollar a man inside GVO. It gives you so much. <laughs> <laughs> a, a lot more than a lot of people really understand that, that yeah, if we started yeah. telling you, it would literally overwhelm you. So what we do is we start off with the autoresponder system. That's where we start off with the 
because that's going to get you familiarized with one of the most important tools and foundational tools within your business. Like Janelle's saying over here in the chat, she's saying that she sees everybody posting the same capture page for DS Domination. It's absolutely true. They're posting and all... It's the same for every other business as well. It, it is. It is. And that's one of the, the, the problems that, again, we're identifying, we're going to bring to the market, we're going to solve. That's one of the the solutions that we're offering. DS Domination offers a, a fantastic solution, which is everybody knows. You don't have to recruit to be able to make money with DS Domination. You come in 19 bucks, and, and you can start making money right away. So that, that's a given. No recruiting, no websites. You don't even need any of that stuff. But there are people, there are people out there like you, like me, who want to build a team of people, individuals, who, who want to build a network. And that's what we're doing. We're, we're, we're building an online empire and being able to offer the things that GBO is going to allow everybody to offer um, in the phase three section of, of the the system. We haven't actually gotten to the creation of that. We're still on phase two. Phase two is simply leverage and automation. We're going to show you how to automate your business. Now when we say automate, automation still requires human interaction. You still need to push the button on the system to make it work. Okay. Now when we say push the buttons, this is literally what you've got here, guys. You have a push button system. What I want to do is I want to jump onto my desktop. I want to show you guys a little bit of the follow-up sequence, kind of give you an idea just here inside the webinar that you guys uh, can see what your role is when it comes to editing this thing because I haven't had a chance to actually record the video to show it to you. Anybody who's watching this one, Janelle for example, you're over here saying you teach us how to create your own unique capture pages, which is absolutely true. We give you a video that you can use okay, in the original listing just to show you how to build the page, but it, obviously it's into your benefit to be able to create a unique page, a unique video yourself for example. Just, just reach out, just sit in front of your computer and don't script this guys. One of the worst things in the world is a script. And the reason why I say that if you've ever been called by a telemarketer and they sound like they're reading something, you can tell, okay? And it just turns it turns me off right away. It means this person's just doing this just to do it. They're just going through the motions. This person, if I have a problem, they're not going to be able to assist me. I'm going to have to go transfer the game all over the place. I don't really like doing that. But if a person can come from the heart, if you can say, why are you here and what are you doing? And that person just tells you like that without a script, they know. You see what I mean? They know. There's a lot of people when you say, what are you doing? I'm trying to make a lot of money. Well, that's generic. We don't want to be generic. We want to be very specific as to what it is that we're trying to do. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is jump onto my desktop, show you guys this email follow-up sequence that we have for you so you can see how valuable it really is. Okay, there's a lot of good emails in it. Bear with me. Share screen. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, so Luke, if you could let me know. You can see this. Remember, there's a delay of uh, I think around 10 seconds. So. So you should be uh, like the can see screen. that, yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hop over here to GBO. And this is my GBO autoresponder account. I already have the, the campaigns messages. And in mine's, the one that you guys are going to have is going to look a little bit different. As you guys can see right here, I have a limit of 50,000 subscribers. Uh, uh, in this particular account, I have two GBO accounts. This one has 1,935 subscribers in it. And, and there's a whole bunch of lists. And this is me really just tinkering around with the autoresponder. Learn how to build GDI. This was the very first list that we ever built um, within, GD, uh, within GBO and we were running a system similar to this in the past, um, but it was really confusing for people because we didn't understand how simple we needed to make it. We've made a lot of adjustments since then. <laughs> so what we have here is we have our, our DSD editable campaign, and this is the one that you'll load into your autoresponder when you follow those steps in the videos uh, on, on the phase two for uh, globaltakeover.com slash campaign or wherever you're actually finding these steps because some of the team members that we have are, are actually working on the phase three processes and building their own websites and, and stuff like that. So you might be seeing this information on a different website other than Global World Takeover, uh, but you'll get the idea. It's, it's, it's all going to be the same. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at the messages here. We're going to go ahead and click on that. And it's going to bring up a list of all of our messages for this particular campaign. As you can see, there are quite a few here. And realistically, they're spaced out to where it's actually going to be following up with the person who opts into your campaign. Uh, I think it's for about four and a half months. Okay, so you've got from the time a person gives you their email address to 
four and a half months later before you stop communicating with that person about your business opportunity, that's not even going to include the broadcast emails that you're going to send out in between those time frames. That's what I was going to mention. <laughs> we'll actually go into a little bit about um, what broadcast emails are in another training mm -hmm. because it's, it's a little bit more involved. It's where you're sending uh, an individual email personally, but it goes out to your entire list all at the same time. Whereas the sequenced emails, these are going to go out to an individual subscriber one at a time. Um, so for example, if I could subscribe to this list today, I would get this email, um, and then the next day I would get this email, and then the day after that. And then if, if Luke subscribed and I was on the day three email, he would get the day one email and, and follow through with that sequence. So that's pretty much how it goes. So right here in our first email, what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to actually open this up. Okay, so you just click on it to open it. And you'll see inside of here, it's actually relatively simple to edit. Okay, we made it as easy as possible. Um, there is a, a way where we can make it to where you just put in a couple of forms into what's called global fields, but that's not going to help you be able to wrap your mind as an individual around what the email campaigns are designed to do. So what we want you to do is we want you to actually come into these. We want you to read them and then input your links where the links are going to go. So uh, the 45, 46 emails, whatever the emails are. It's if uh, Luke, how long did it take you to go through these and edit yours? I know you finished yours up. Uh, it took me, I, don't, I started yesterday, so it took me around a day and a half. Um, that's just because what I, the reason why, what I done was I went into each email and I made it unique to me. So it took me yeah, around a day and a half, but that's not, you know, a full 25 hours. That's just, you know, doing a few hours at a time and doing a game tomorrow. It doesn't, it doesn't take that long, but I'd recommend that you go into every email and specify it to yourself so it looks, um, you know, like you, you're a real person and stuff, you know, and it's um, genuine to you. Because these are just generic emails, which I'm um, angry, you know. Directed toward you know DS domination than they were before, but they are like Luke said was a little better. Um, so when you're going through these guys, this campaign from name you can leave that as it is, because uh, when you edit the campaign, you're actually going to put your name in there, and that's going to automatically populate your name everywhere it says that. Um, but you can you can erase that. You can just type your name in there if you choose to, because that's what you want it to say is Hey, it's me again. And then just go through here, and everywhere there's a link. Okay, you'll highlight it. You'll click right on this little link up here. And what you're going to do is you're going to put a link in this link URL. Make sure that this opens up on a new window, okay, for blank, so that it, they stay in the email as well as have whatever website you want them to go to opened up. Um, and then you're going to put in a page, okay, and this is where people get confused if they have not seen the system in action. You're going to put a page to your website here that correlates, that, that corresponds with what the email is talking about. So if, for example, there's a person, there's an email in here, and this one is talking about make sure you've watched the complete webinar. Well, where you're going to get the webinar from is the webinar in DS Domination. There's two webinars. One is one of the highest converting webinars that they've ever done in DS Domination, so they keep it, and you can put that link in there. Or the other one is just the, the most recent webinar. Okay, and that's so those are the DS domination webinars, the pro webinars where they're te they're talking about the opportunity, what DS domination has to offer, uh, and that's what this particular one will say. Because right here, you can see that obviously, make sure you have watched the complete webinar. So make sure you guys are reading these emails <laughs> so that you know what link goes in that spot. Okay, because you don't that's want to watch the complete webinar and send them over to a page that says buy now. You know what I mean? <laughs> that's why I think it's a really good idea that everyone has to go into the emails individually so they know exactly what's going on because if somebody then asks a question about an email what's being sent and you have no clue it's not going to look that good so make sure you know exactly what's going on so if you have questions you can respond to them with a good answer. Exactly, exactly. That That is incredibly important. Now this particular email number two, okay, though it's the second email, these two go out back to back on the same day. Um, guys, you need to pay attention, really close attention to this particular email. For example, Luke is not eligible to do this because he lives in the United Kingdom and this offer is only available in the United States. So when you come into here, if you are outside of the United States, you have a couple of options that you can do. You're going to be able to put in here, you've got your testimonials page right here in red that it says put your testimonials page here, <laughs> okay? <laughs> Make sure that you put a page that's got some testimonials about the DS Domination opportunity. There. Now down here it says claim your first month of DS Domination Pro rebate. Um, there is a net spend card, 
Okay, if you're outside of the United States, you can still send people to the net spend card. You make sure you send it to, for example, um, one of your upline members, whoever they are, who has a affiliate link because they the person who gets this card cannot get a bonus onto the card unless they get it from an affiliate link of somebody who can offer that bonus, which is somebody who got the card through the affiliate link. Okay, if you if you just follow through there, they, they, you'll get the idea. Uh, but what you can do is just that person can still take advantage of it and still use this process, which will benefit you in the future. It just doesn't benefit you directly. Um, another thing that we do when I say your rebate is the net spend offer that's in this in this little line right here provides that person that gets the card a $20 bonus when they activate the card, as well as I get a $20 commission when they activate the card. What I do with the $20 commission is I simply send that to their PayPal account uh, to cover the first month of their DS Domination Pro membership. That way they can really get going, because remember guys, we're solving a problem, and that problem is, number one, there's a lot of hype in this industry that people just spend money on stuff and they don't make any money in return, and number two is we know Everybody who's actually followed the instructions in DS Domination knows that the first month that person is in this system, they're going to make money, period. If they follow the steps, okay, if you follow... <laughs> That's what I was going to say. Make... <coughs> don't go ever... <laughs> when then, It doesn't matter what it is. If you don't follow the steps, you're not going to get any results whatsoever. But as Andrew said... You can make money in the first. It took me, you know, two days to make money with this information. But as long as you're taking the steps and actually doing what it's telling you to do, then you'll right. make money. It's incredibly important that you 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 do what the training is teaching you to do. Don't do this to yourself, okay? What a lot of people will do is they'll always want to know what's next without taking action on what's next. What's that? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a turntable. <laughs> oh no, I was. No, 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 there was a button on my thing, so I was just scratching it. Did it sound like I was doing some mix? It sounded like it. Yeah, it did actually. Uh, but uh, what, what what people will do is they'll they'll want to know the next step. So what we'll do is we'll say what you need to do is you need to get pro. Okay, and you need to go through the pro membership and you need to follow the instructions. They won't, okay? And then they'll say, what do I do next? And then they'll take, they'll want to take the next step. So obviously we don't want to hold anybody back, so we'll tell you what the next step is. So now you've got to go through all the steps in pro and do what it's telling you to do. Plus you've got to do step two. Then what they do is they ask, I want to know what's next. So you tell them what's next. Now they have three things that they have to do, and right now at this point, they're overwhelmed. So make sure that you don't fall into that statistical category and you do these steps one step at a time, and I promise you that the result at the end of the steps, even if you don't understand why you're taking that step, take them in faith, knowing that we understand the outcome that you're really after here, and that's an automated business that will operate whether or not you are working or not. That's what you're after, right? That's what we're going to show you how to get, okay? So make sure that you do follow these steps. Take action, and I'm stressing this point because I've done this for so long that I know that most people just will not take these action steps. Don't be like that person. Make sure you take the steps, edit these emails, build your website, and make sure that you start doing these things. At the end of the construction of your site, guys, I, I've got some really cool training that I'm going to give to you, show you how you can generate leads, start getting traffic to your capture pages absolutely free of charge. Okay, so you're not going to have to pay for that until you've got the money to do it. Now, realistically, you should have money coming in from eBay right now. You shouldn't be here unless you have some money coming in from eBay so you can cover your system. But you, you, you're going to want to be able to generate uh, some traffic right away so you can test your funnel and you don't want to pay for all that kind of stuff. So we're going to show you how to do that. Okay, um, Luke, you're really good at Facebook. If you could kind of give maybe some some hints, some, maybe some nuggets, a little bit of, of teasers, if you will, uh, as to what, what type of uh, training they can expect to get from us when it comes to just Facebook alone. Facebook alone, um, I love Facebook, as, as Andrew said. I have um, got every single sound, I think, literally from Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> Facebook is um, yeah, it's, it's a gold mine if you use it differently to everybody else. You basically don't do what everybody else is doing, and this is, and this is my tip. Do not go into groups spamming them. Do not spam people's inbox with rubbish. Do not... Do not tell people how they can get rich quick. Do not tell people how they can do this. All that kind of rubbish. Simply go into um, 
So you go to Facebook and connect with people and just give value. That's it. <laughs> that sounds so that sounds so silly, but literally that works. <laughs> just literally give value to people. Now, what give kind value. of value? I mean, when you say give value to people, what do you mean? I mean, do you mean do you mean like just throw out there some some stuff that that like this is valuable? Here, take this. You should buy from me. Well, what do you mean by value? Sure, sure, sure. By value, don't show up. When you go into Facebook, you have um, let, let me give you an example. You have Facebook groups. Um, you know, they're called some you know make my online and stuff like that. You see people just posting their um, ads over and over again. And they're not getting anything from them. So what we've done and what I've done is, I simply sent a message to some people. They said, "Hey, can you tell me some more about your business opportunity?" That conversation flows. They tell me all about that business opportunity. Then the question comes, "What do I do?" And then I explain, "What do I do? I make money. Uh, I'm using a system which makes money about recruiting people. <gasps> What's that about?" <laughs> <laughs> that's literally all I because I don't I don't want to make it sound harder than what it is because it's not that's literally what I do. I, and that's what I mean connect with people. When if if I say to you how are you, it's quite common you're gonna ask me how am I back. <laughs> so when you ask somebody what what are they doing, you tell them more about your business opportunity, naturally you're indirectly asking them something that <laughs> you're gonna get a good question back. What do you do? <laughs> And it's a really, really good way to get linked. It's, um, for me, it's been the best way. It's worked every single time. How many people, uh, since you started doing it, would you say that you've actually personally enrolled into, it doesn't really matter what it was, GBO, DS Domination, okay. whatever. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I've done, I would say, oh, 50, 60. From Facebook, 70 people, roughly. But just just personal personal enrollments. That's that's personal. The the downline of GBO was over um hundred, wasn't it? Ninety something. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> personal <laughs> There's look, quite a few people that, that came came in from that method and that's why it's GBO was like forty five. DS domination is over twenty. So it's like seventy person. And that's just from Facebook. That's not from doing anything for And um, how much why that that was up to date because you you're still getting paid from that. Um, that was, uh, up to date, multiple thousands. Yes, because the the reason why I found, uh, <laughs> the reason why I can't give an exact figure is because for the work I have done then is still paying off now. So I do not have a clue when it's going to stop. <laughs> <laughs> I done awesome. I done the work for, I done the work for. Um, for a month with um, GBO and stuff like that, and still to this day, I still get money for it. When you say to this day, how long has it been? <laughs> six months. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you only worked for one month, and you've been getting paid for six. That's fantastic. See, so guys, that's yeah. what we're talking about. This is the point behind leverage and automation is to be able to generate income on autopilot. Now one of the things that we use is the autoresponder just to kind of give you guys an example of what that is. It's a robot that sends emails on your behalf. So here's the thing guys. Uh, I see a lot of stuff that a lot of people are upset. The automated teller machine, the ATM. I don't know if you guys paid a lot of attention. I was probably eight years old when that thing came out. And and people were, the bank tellers were particularly upset about it. Saying, oh, we're getting replaced by a machine. now. Honestly, in my opinion, if your job is so easy that a machine can do it, you should probably think about getting a better job. And number two, if a machine <laughs> is doing their job, okay, don't you think that it would be cool, if you will, if that machine that was doing your job that never asked for a paycheck would let you get the pay from the job that it's doing? Now that's what the autoresponder is doing. It never takes a break. It never goes to union. They don't have that. It doesn't ask for health and benefits. It doesn't ask for weekends off or more time with the family. It doesn't need a raise. Okay, it doesn't need any of that stuff. And every single time it does a job for you, you get paid. Isn't that awesome? We love robots. So any way that we can we can implore a robot to do our job for us, we will do that. It's a very good go friendly robot. robot. <laughs> not these all, not these spammy robots. It's a very good robot. 
<laughs> I like I like to I like that 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 concept, and that's what we're doing. We're really putting robots to work for us. We get the paycheck. The robot don't say anything. They don't care, and it just keeps on trucking along and working away on our behalf. And that's that's the point, guys. And that's what we're gonna go through. We're gonna teach you how to do this. I've got a couple of other products that are gonna help you automate some other sections of your business, um, as well as as um, building your list now. The autopilot system is so easy to do. The thing is, if you even take an, an autopilot into consideration on an airplane, okay, the, the human, we still need to interact with the system whether or not it's taking off or landing the machine, okay? Once it's going, the autopilot itself takes over and it flies wherever it needs to go. It does not need the human interaction. Okay, and that's what we're doing. We're setting up a system to where we help it take off and then it just goes to where we want it to go on autopilots, but we don't have to. We're gonna have to have the human interaction and by that I mean we're gonna have to run the ads. We're gonna have to physically go in. We're gonna have to, number one, we're gonna have to set it up. Okay, we're gonna have set up so that it's working. You don't have it right now in place. You will by the time you're done following our system. You'll have it done. You'll have an understanding of what's really going on. Then we're gonna take you and we're gonna put you into something that you're gonna. It's just gonna blow your mind at how much money is available for you. And you're not gonna change anything you're doing. The only thing that you're going to do is you're gonna step up one more step to that to that that pedestal that you need to be on so that your system is automatically flying to the destination that you want it to be, which is true freedom, not financial freedom, because money don't matter. Guys, this stuff right here, this stuff's a joke, okay? It's just paper. It is a medium of exchange. It's just yeah. paper. You have no idea. People waste their entire lives to get this stupid piece of paper, and as soon as they get it, they can't wait to get rid of it. Are you freaking kidding me? Come on, it's, it, it doesn't really exist, and all you need to do is get this illusion flowing through your life. Once you've got it flowing, it just amplifies, and we'll show you how to scale as well. Scaling is just simply taking, if you put $20 in and you got $21 back, well, what do you do? You put $40 in, so you get $42 back. You know what I mean? And you just keep scaling that up, and that $1 becomes significant money. The Walmart, for example, is one of the most profitable corporations in the world, and they only profit 3% of their gross sales, which is insane. So keep that stuff in mind. If, if Walmart can make the Walton family one of the richest families on the planet with a 3% profit margin, what can you do? With fifty percent, with with three hundred percent, with one hundred percent, with all these different profit margins that we have within our own system, guys, the sky is the limit. I don't want to keep you guys any longer. I know these things can go on forever. Luke, do you have any final thoughts, sir? I'm good. Just remember one thing. I just got to say one thing. <laughs> take action. <laughs> take I always, I always, always, and every single webinar like that. Just take action. Just literally take action. Get plugged in. Take action. Um, get the marketing system. You know, complete. I don't know what level you're at at the moment. I'm not so sure who's on board, but get the marketing system complete. Get all the emails done and um, start automating everything. And remember, have fun at the same time. <laughs> remember to always have fun. You don't want to make this into a day job again. You want to make it into something you can enjoy at the same time. So have fun. Have fun, make money, make it liberating. Guys, it was a pleasure. We appreciate you as always. My name is Andrew Newman. Thank you, Luke, for, for sharing your time with us this evening. It's always a pleasure having you. Yeah, okay. um, you guys, have a great day. If you haven't joined our team yet, somewhere around this video, if you're watching the replay, there is some buttons you can click on. Click on those buttons, pull out your credit card, get started today. I promise you, you won't regret it. We'll talk to you in the future, guys. Have a good one. Take care.